Local school kids have transformed their imaginations into works of art for this year's Peninsula Schools Art Exhibition. They've created pieces including paintings, photos and masks. Bayfield High Head of Art Rennie Lammers says there are about 400 pieces on show this week. And he says the show is a great way to recognise the talent in local schools. The whole idea is to uh, celebrate what the kids do. And we've always heard about numeracy, literacy and how important that is. Um, we've forgotten how important the actual visual arts are. The expo has been running for about 30 years now and numerous schools in the city contribute to it. Lammers says this year's event has the Māori tanifa as a theme but the interpretation of that is up to the pupils. Whether it's a, the Māori imagery of tanifa, which you'll see a lot of them taking that, um, or whether it's just a tanifa in your own personal way, some kind of demon, so you can do it that way. So that's what the theme was this year. Lammers says there's a competitive edge to the expo as well, with small prizes up for grabs. And it'll be a Dunedin City Councillor who decides the victors. David Benson Pope's going to be our judge this year. Uh, he's coming at one o'clock, so we'll judge it. And what we do here, we judge the best work in, in two runner-ups type of thing. Um, it's the hardest thing to do, so it's not saying the best image or the best process, but what the judge, well basically what appeals to him. Lammers says the public will have a chance to see the expo later this week. And he's hoping the crowds will come out, so young artists can see the local support for their craft. David DeLorean, 39, Dunedin News.